How to crochet the connected spiral stitch. For this stitch, you'll need a crochet hook. Special thanks to our sponsor, Webs, for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Northampton yarn from their Valley Yarns line in the color light gray. For this stitch, you'll need to know the following techniques. Chain stitch, double crochet, cluster four stitch which is a special abbreviation that we will be covering in the video. To begin this stitch, you must create a foundation chain in multiples of three plus five. Row one, we're going to begin by doing a double crochet into the sixth chain from our hook. So we'll yarn over and we'll count one, two, three, four, five, six. Then we'll start our repeat by doing a chain three. So we're at one, two, and three. Then we're going to do our cluster four. So to do this, we will do three double crochets over the stem of the double crochet that we've just created. This is one right here. And as we work these, we're only going to work through the first two loops. So we'll leave this loop on, we'll yarn over, So I'm starting a new double crochet here with each set. And this is going to give me four loops on my hook. Then I'm going to do one more double crochet, but I'm going to do this two chains away from this stem. So we'll skip two, yarn over, insert my hook, draw through, and we're only going to finish the first part of this. So we'll draw through the first two. That gives me five loops on my hook. Then we'll yarn over and draw through all five loops, like so. Okay, and we're going to repeat this sequence until we reach the last uh, two chains in our row. All right, when we reach the last two chains in our row, we are going to chain three. And then we will work a cluster four like usual. But we're gonna work the last double crochet here. I've split my yarn, here we go. Into the last chain of our row. Okay, we've got five loops and we'll finish off. Okay, and then we will turn our work. Row two, we're going to begin by chaining three. This will count as a double crochet. Then we'll do one double crochet into the next three chain space, which is this space right here. And we'll start our repeat by chaining three. And we will work a cluster four into this double crochet here. And we'll work the last double crochet here into the next three chain space. Okay, and then we'll yarn over and draw through all five loops on our hook. And we will repeat this sequence until the end of our, till our last repeat of the row. So I'm gonna finish up my last repeat here by doing a cluster four. I've already completed most of it. And I'm going to do the last double crochet into the top chain of our turn chain in the previous row. So once I have five loops, I'll yarn over and draw through all five, and then I will turn my work. Okay, so we're gonna repeat row two until we've reached our desired length. And that's how you crochet the connected spiral stitch.
Want more news to today? Check out our website at newstoday.com.